Anilao is a protected marine sanctuary in the island of Luzon, approximately 100 kilometers south of Manila. Its status as a marine sanctuary makes it an environment rich in thriving corals and biodiversity. Anilao often features among the top three places in the world for muck diving, which focuses on finding small and bizarre creatures in the sand and coral formations. There are over 50 dive sites in the area for muck divers to choose from, ranging from shallow to deep dives with varying currents. Anilao is home to an incredible diversity of nudibranchs with hundreds of species. Divers can also encounter a variety of fascinating crustaceans, including colorful shrimp, crabs, and lobsters. Cephalopods, such as octopuses, cuttlefish, and squid, many of which can be photographed on the seabed or on blackwater dives that Anilao has become famous for globally. The coconut octopus, also known as the veined octopus, is an interesting cephalopod found in the tropical waters of the Western Pacific Ocean. This octopus is named for its unique behavior of using discarded open coconuts as portable hiding places. The coconut octopus can use tools, an ability once thought limited to humans and a few other primates. This species of octopus is also known for its inquisitive and playful personality and has been observed engaging in frisky behavior with divers. In this dive at the Anilao Pier, we encountered two individuals, one of which was shy and just wanted to hide in the sand, while the other one loved posing with his shell in front of the camera. The Starry Night Octopus, also known as the Starry Dwarf Octopus, is a small species found in the tropical waters of the Indo-Pacific. They use their eight arms to walk along the seafloor, searching for small crustaceans and other invertebrates to feed on. When they spot prey, they use their arms to surround and trap it before delivering a deadly bite with their beak-like jaws. The sexy shrimp, also known as the squat shrimp, is a small species that grows to about 13 millimeters in length. The shrimp carries its abdomen curved upwards with its tail fan above its head, making it easy to recognize. The sexy shrimp live symbiotically with corals, sea anemones, and other marine invertebrates. The female shrimp carries the fertilized eggs under her abdomen until they are ready to hatch. Harlequin shrimps are well known for their striking blue and pink coloration, which changes depending on the color of the prey they eat. They have an interesting feeding behavior where they flip the starfish onto their backs and attack the softer underside, which is where the starfish's vital organs are located. They use their sharp claws to pull apart the starfish's arms and then feed on the soft tissue inside. 
Harlick and shrimp are also intriguing for their monogamous mating behavior. Once they mate, the female lays a cluster of eggs, which the male guards and aerates until they hatch. This devotion to their offspring is uncommon among crustaceans. Frogfish are a member of the anglerfish family. They are known for their unique appearance, resembling a small, colorful blob with fins. Frogfish can change their color and texture to blend in with their surroundings, making them expert ambush predators. They use a rod-like appendage on their head, the elysium, as bait to lure an unsuspecting fish. Any fish unfortunate to fall for this trick is then quickly sucked up into the frogfish's large mouth. Frogfish also have a unique way of swimming, using their fins to walk along the seafloor instead of propelling themselves through the water. Jawfishes are small fish that construct burrows in sandy substrate for protection and feeding. Using the protection of these burrows, these fish will hover, feeding on plankton or other small organisms, ready to dart back in at the first sign of danger. Jawfishes are territorial and defend their burrow area aggressively. Most are mouth brooders, with eggs hatching inside the mouths of the parents. Goby fish are a diverse and fascinating group of fish. They are characterized by their elongated and often brightly colored bodies and their ability to make home in a variety of different artifacts. The one seen here has chosen a beer bottle as home for his family, which he guards jealously. Despite their diversity, Many species of gobies are threatened by habitat loss, overfishing, and pollution. Gobies are excellent diggers and can excavate complex burrows in the sand or coral rubble. They often share these burrows with shrimp, who act as housekeepers Despite being blind, the shrimp have a keen sense of smell and can detect predators approaching the burrow and can warn the goby using their antennae. On the other hand, the goby guards the entrance to the burrow and lets the shrimp know when it is safe to come out with his piles of rubble. In exchange for all their work and effort, the shrimp receive protection and a place to live. Cleaning shrimp and eels have a symbiotic relationship in which the shrimp feed on parasites and dead skin from the eel's body, while the eel provides protection and a source of food for the shrimp. This partnership is another example of how animals can work together to achieve mutual benefits in the wild. The puffer fish when threatened, it inflates its body, transforming into a spiky ball that makes it difficult for predators to swallow. However, what's even more fascinating is their eyes. Unlike other fish, puffer fish have a unique eye structure that allows them to see in two different directions at the same time. Each eye can move independently, giving them a 360 degree view of their surroundings. Annie Lau is a world-leading example of marine conservation. 
The establishment of the marine protected areas in 1991 marked the initial steps towards saving the area. These parks are diligently maintained by committees of local villagers who actively enforce fishing restrictions and prohibit anchoring within the protected zones. Dive tourism has also played a role in preserving the reefs as fishing boats have transformed into diving vessels. While finding a balance between short-term gains and long-term sustainability remains a challenge, the villagers of Ani Lao have showcased their dedication to proper stewardship. By demonstrating that responsible management can ensure both sufficient food resources and the economic benefits of dive tourism, they serve as an inspiring example. Ani Lao offers the best of both worlds. A destination where conservation and local communities thrive in harmony, making it a truly exceptional place to experience. Let's hope it remains that way for generations to come.